All right, hi everyone, and welcome to all my 78s UK. I have a very, very warped uh, 78 here. In fact, as you can see, it's a bit of a fruit bowl, really. Um, yeah, so it's, uh, yeah, it's, <laughs> yeah. So we're gonna have a go. I'm gonna have a go, a go at, uh, at uh, flattening it out with the old hairdryer. So this is this is a quick one. Let's see let's see what we can do. Right, so having another look, as you can see, it's uh, if I hold this end down, you can see this is this is very bad, very bad indeed. And uh, concave, oh, convex that side, very concave that side. Fruit bowl, fruit bowl. Right, let's uh, let's have a go. Let's see what we can. Uh, we can do. Right, it's gone flat. Let's put some weight on it this time. Uh, I'll put some weight on it. I'll put a, there's probably about 12 78s there that I've laid on top of it. And this is uh, a stone. So that will absorb the heat. And uh, hopefully when I take this off, it will be flat forever and ever and ever. Well, one hopes anyway. It's been about half an hour since I uh, f uh, finished um, de-warping that uh, 78. I put some 78s on top as a bit of a, a bit of a weight on it while it was cooling down. And we're going to have a look in a minute. While I've been doing that, while I've been waiting, I have been surfing around on the uh, on the uh, channels and that, and uh, listening to a uh, to a few uh, uploads. Victrola Jazz. Is a great upload uh, uploader of 78s. He does some fantastic 20s jazz, has a fantastic collection. It must have a just amazing library of uh, Victrola 78s and other 78s. So definitely worth popping over and seeing him if you've not done so. And his link to his channel is underneath here. So uh, remember that. And uh, oh, sorry about this. Oh, so very unprofessional. <laughs> yes, hello. Yeah, I'll, mm, yeah, I would. Yeah, yes, 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 I will. Yes, do it now. Yes, okay. Right, bye. bye, bye. Oh, <laughs> yes, uh, Greg's Gramophones and Music. He is another great channel that you need to check out. And he is also have a link underneath there. So let's get back to this now before that phone goes. And I get other people trying to give them shout outs. Right, so... Um, what we're going to do? We're going to we're going to lift this off, and we're going to see if this seventy eight has gone flat. And this is the second video that I've done on flattening ones, but the first one that I've done with putting a bit of weight on. And there was a subscriber, which I will put up now. And he was he left a comment, and he said he puts his in the oven. I said I might try and do that one day, but I'm I'm very weary, especially of this one. But I did about a trick of his was to put some 78s on top to weigh down the cooling 78 so that it stays flat. And so I've used that trick to, to this, and I and I have had good success so far. But this is the first time I've done it on camera, so it could all go wrong. Let's get it off, let's get them off, and let's see what's happening. Oh. Right, we'll have a look now. That is still not 100%. It's still not 100%, but it's a lot better than what it was. Yes, it's, it's, it's not great, but it is better. And I'm wondering now if I was to do the same on this side and then put some weight down, that might help. So that's what I'm going to do next. So I'll be straight back with this. Right, let's see how that goes. Mm. 
Right, I've <laughs> yes, I was just um, just watching some more videos before I uncover to see if we have managed to get the uh, 78 RPM record, uh, the shellac record, the one that was warped uh, nice and flat. That would be great, wouldn't it? So I was just uh, so I better do a shout out for and it's uh, aha the channel the channel name is DJA. 69 and he is also in the descriptions underneath and these are all great great channels that upload some fantastic uh 78 rpm record uh records really uh content it's just fantastic so uh if you're new to this channel and you want to get into what listening to uh some great 78s then you'll find them uh in in the description and many more and many more which i'm going to be trying to do more shout outs for uh, people in this fantastic community. And it is a great community to be in, involved in, uh, because especially nowadays with all this self-isolating and uh, things going on with this terrible coronavirus that's going around. So, I mean, I'm in my shed. Uh, it's a coronavirus-free environment. Uh, the wife is happy indoors. She's happy not going out. She doesn't want to go out. I don't want to go out. I want to stay here. And I've been starting to sort out my 78 RPM collection uh, so that I can get some more really uh, interesting um, uh, content up. Anyway, a lot of chat this, but I'm doing it because you might have more time on your hands to listen to me. <laughs> yes, and you might be thinking, no, I haven't. No, I haven't. But you might do. You never know. Yes, you might. You might. You might not know. And I know there's a few of you that like to put me on double speed. That's not fair. So I'm going to slow myself down now so that it's, I'm running at the right speed. Yes, so I'm going to be moving this uh, coffee. Oh, a nice, nice cup of coffee, this one. Hmm. I usually have something a bit stronger, but today I'm having coffee. And then I'm going to um, take this off. And we'll, well, we'll take it off, a bit closer up, and you can see if it's actually worked. Remember how bad it was? It was this bad. Right, so that was how bad it was, and now we are going to take this off and just see if it's any, if it's if it's really really flat or it's just. Uh, let's get this off. Over here, check it out. Ah, look at that. That is as flat as a pancake. That is as flat as a pancake. Turn it over. Look at that. Well. All right, there's a little bit there, but I bet you they're all 78s are a little bit, aren't they? Let's put it on the gramophone player and see what it's like when it's uh, going around, yeah? Right, so I'm going to put it on. I'm not going to play it because um, I want to make sure it's completely cold before I play it because it, it is a little bit too warm. It doesn't feel it doesn't feel warm, really, but if it is, it might might damage it but that's just we're just going to turn it on and see what it's like well i'm going to say that that's about as flat as anyone's going to get any 78 um even if well it's as flat as all the ones that i haven't had to do warp i mean that is flat so there you go right so there you are um it works uh I think the hair dryer, using a hair dryer on a really flat, something really flat, and this is, you can get these from most um, stores and that that's, that sell kitchen things and that. Um, a nice hard stone one, um, nice and flat, a hair dryer, and a bit of weight on top. And the weight, now the weight came from, I'll get this, this guy's name right, Daniel R. Eric. Daniel Arick and uh, he he left a comment on my first video that I did a I did a de-warping and uh, he's, he he tries the uh, he does the uh, the oven method where you put it in the oven I'm going to say I was going to try it but I don't think I will I pre think I prefer the um the method that I've just done because I think it's a lot safer um and, and a lot easier to do you just put the record on there you just keep going around with the hair dryer till it falls flat it falls flat then i'll use this method we're putting some other 78s on top using it as a weight to hold down the 78 while it is cooling off 
because they can, while they cool off, they can start to warp, warp, lift up again. They have like a memory. So you're trying to get over that memory and uh, of it going back to where it was. So the weight, thank you for the tip, by the way, um, does, uh, does actually uh, help, as you've seen. I mean, it, it did go back, but when I turned it around the other side and did the other side and put the weight down, it helped to flatten it out. So if you've got 78s that are a bit, bit warpy, this, I think, is the most definite way to do it. This and your wife's hairdryer. You can see I don't really need a hairdryer, but the, the wife's hair. I haven't told her that I borrowed it, actually, so um, don't say anything. <laughs> right. right, there you go. That's it. That's all I want to show you this time. And um, the next time I come back will be for a march update uh, because i'm not going on my camping trip because of the coronavirus uh, i'd have to use public transport to get there three trains two buses and it's not just worth it's not worth it and uh, everyone's got to stay inside and try not to pass it around to help the vulnerable which is what we should be doing anyway enough on that this is a 78 rpm channel now i am going to carry on now and uh, watch some more of your videos. Thanks for watching and I'll be back probably in a week.